Okay, so now you can hear me. Today I thought I'd show you some exercises that I do in my little pool that apparently is lopsided. I don't know if it has a leak or what it, but here, let me show you some exercises. So it has a little seat here. It's so new that it's so slippery. Um, since I fell back on it, what I can do is like up and down my leg lifts for this like this. It activates my muscles. I can really feel my quads working like this and I put my hand on my leg and it doesn't take much effort. Um Here we go. Here's what I was trying to show you. Okay. Alright, so here is actually quite fun and study so challenging. I think I want to do this. I don't know if you can see this, but I'm going to do my own now. I'm sitting down. Some other things I was trying to do, this is kind of weird with how slippery it is and how upsided it is, but I was trying to get into like a squatting position. Keyword trying. <laughs> yeah, still no Um, but, um, some other things that I've been doing are just push up, holding the planes and then going down. I don't really want to get my feet wet. <laughs> and then there's all where I do my thing in. in much. I think after I get squatting down, I might be able to jump my legs. Oh. 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 chill with the drink because the pool has drink holders on both sides right here. But, oh, this is a nice two sides. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> I feel that working like my, um, my midsection of 
of it. And then just bringing my legs out and together. Out and together. I don't know if you can see that, but for me, it doesn't feel like I'm doing much, but once I get out, I feel it. So that's a good thing. I really hope this is working. I can't see at all. Alright. And then always stretch. It's a good idea to stretch. Um, the one thing I don't like about this pool is hard to get out of. Um, with it being lopsided, maybe not so much. But I have to like roll over. I don't think I can get out from it. Um, some other stuff I was thinking of doing would be like getting a kickboard and trying to surf on it. I feel like that would be effective. Um, and then I was gonna get ankle weights in here to try and like as I get better to add on of course because of that that <laughs> might not be the best plan until I figure out what's going on with that um and that's basically what I was doing I'm still really working on I wanted to be able to do lunch like I can I can meal but I could do that anyway my knees go up when I'm like this, so try to push them down. It is hard, but ooh, I feel it working, so that might be a good exercise. Actually, I put a buzzer exercise just only my knees down. Um, trying to put one up like this. Yeah, I'm doing it in water with a spoon. It was pretty good. Once I'm some balance there, maybe I can do it with some other things, we'll see. I'll like grab my foot and move it where I want. Oh yeah, okay. Like there's that's a challenge. Alright, well um hopefully you guys can hear me. If not don't worry, I found a way to edit so I can go back over and talk. Oh, it's cold now, I'm just going to hang out here for a little bit. Um, I want to show you guys how I get out, but I'm not sure. Because, that, like I said, that's one of like, the most challenging things for me is getting out of this. But at the same time, it's so hot here, it's kind of nice just chilling out. Would have been nice if I had brought a drink out, but oh well. So I've been working on um, cleaning up the space to do like an exercise room upstairs. So when I get that done, don't, don't hold your breath. It's going to be a long time before <laughs> it's finished, but I will definitely show you guys. Um, and then I've been watching a lot of like do-it-yourself videos of um, like exercise equipment even, which is really cool to see. So there's that. Oh uh, yeah, so like the bridge that I want to do, I have like really sensitive to this water, and I don't really want to put my head in. But, like, the bridge that I was trying to do that I couldn't do the other day, I was trying to do that so that I can go up with my legs, so that's a good one, too. And then just working on holding it. That feels more like it's working on my abs than my legs. But still. And then just, like, trying to float, too. That's another really good out of exercise. I just have my hands sort of under my lower back. And then I'm lifting my legs up and holding it there for a little bit. Almost like I'm floating. But I have my hands on the bottom, so I'm not quite floating.
man. Alright, as for getting up in here, uh -oh, not Watch my head. So I go in to all fours, and then I get up. You know, like how I normally do, like I'm trying to do a full shot. That's not even working right now because I'm tired. And the water. Okay, so I go for like a bit of a push up, kind of. Well, those are some other exercises that I do. There's push ups. I um, have to trick myself. I'm tall, luckily, so this works. But you could do it even if you're not. I could just back my feet up into the into like the wall of it so that they stay and kind of slide. And then just go like down and up. You could do it on your palms. Uh, maybe if my knuckles I can it hurts too much. It hurts my hands. Or just hold it for You just want to have your back straight. And you can see it go up with your arms. Not hurts your arms and your legs at the same time. Oh, and then you can do it on your arms. But yeah, I can't do that. So I go. Even if I like walk my knees in, and then I like to go over it. Oh my god. Oh, that's the other thing. I can do yoga poses. For a second. Okay, so not much better than I can do inside, but. Because I slide, but still. I can. There's the trick. Um, this is how I get out. I'll show you. I put a tarp down here, and then I have to like, oh man, I have to like roll over the side. This one, you know, normally it's up higher, but because it's so lopsided, I might be able to just like cheat a little. Okay. And do, yes, do this, but before I had to like actually really roll. Okay. And that's that. <sighs> I gotta figure out how to get up from here, and then I am good. Okay, so you just saw that swim workout. Um, the hardest thing for me was getting out of the pool, and then also um, now that I'm back, like on land, I guess so to say, my legs are super, super shaky. So it's like I just, I just needed to sit down. I can't even show you right now because it's like. I feel very uh, shaky and like I'm going to fall. Like, um, I might have overdid it. I don't think so, though. But it's that, I don't know if anyone else gets that. But, like, when I overdo it, I kind of feel like, um, like, I kind of have this feeling in my legs. Like, they're shaking and I'm going to fall if I take another step and I need to sit down first. Well, that's the feeling that I have right now. But I really, I don't think I overdid it. I think it's just the difference between, like, being in the water and then going back on, like, where there's gravity, basically. I love the water because there's no gravity is my thing. I just, I wish I had a deeper pool. But for now, that works perfectly to exercise it. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. I know exercise is really important. So, of course, I'm going to keep going up. And, of course, I'm going to keep showing you guys some other videos. Um, we'll see what comes up. I'm honestly, I can't even tell you I have so much on my mind with finals this week, but, um, and, and next week too, so we'll see what happens, hopefully I can get another video up next week, and, um, I thought I was gonna say something else, but I am forgetting, so I'll leave you with that, I hope you guys have a great weekend, hopefully it's not too hot wherever you are. Um, or too cold. I guess it really depends on where you're at. Here it's supposed to be a hot one, which will be good. But anyway, have a good one, and I'll see you next time.